when this was a skate park, uh, about 15 years ago, it closed down after about four years and it turned into a catfish park. And people would come and catch their catfish. And then, uh, let's see, seven or eight years later, we turned it into a skate park again. As you can see, some of these signs, heads and skins removed. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you'd, maybe you like the heads on your catfish, I don't know. thing to invent tricks. Um, once a trick's been done, it's uh, it's kind of, it's been done, you know, you've seen somebody do it. But to invent a trick, it's very, I think it's very, uh, it's a very self-satisfying feeling because you, you know, you're the only one that's ever done this particular trick. Most of the ramps here, uh, we didn't have when I first started skating. We, uh, we had just concrete bowls and um, some pools, you know, to skate. But now the ramps are so perfect, you know, you can change them or, you know, there's no kinks or anything like that. So uh, it just makes it a lot easier to learn tricks. thing about having my own skate park is I can skate whenever I want to, but the worst thing is fixing the ramps, okay? I don't like fixing the ramps. Fully ramped, man. So annoying. Don't make you twist it in? Yeah, I knew it. Knew it. Kind of like Twisted Sister, but... <laughs> yeah, he told me that down there. But a little, little more spin there, right? Yeah. you guys can come and skate the park we'll be here and either me or my dad or uh, you know the boys will we'll skate you know do some grinds do some twists and um, have a good time so come on over and on that note